A verdict is handed down in a major Rochester murder case. An Olmsted County jury has found Mustafa Bush guilty on two of three murder charges for his role in the death of Kim Robinson in December of 2022. Our Sonata McCall was in the courtroom this afternoon. She joins us live now. So Sonata, what more can you tell us? Hey, Cammie, well, as you've said, this has been a long-awaited verdict, but the jury here at Olmstead County has found that Mustafa Bush is guilty of killing his former partner, Kimberly Robinson. Robinson was found dead in a ditch in northwest Rochester after being shot to death, and the closing arguments began this morning at 8.30 in Olmstead County courtroom. The jury was then left to decide on the verdict this afternoon, which did take about five to six hours from the time closing arguments began. Around 4.28 this afternoon, 12 jury members decided on the three counts Bush was being charged with. They found he is not guilty of first-degree murder premeditated, but he is guilty of first-degree murder while committing domestic abuse with past patterns of domestic abuse and guilty of second-degree murder not premeditated. The judge also made a note that he was altering Bush's release conditions to holding without bail. The court also decided on sentencing date on the sentencing date based on time for families to digest the verdict that was made today as well as for victims to get their impact statements together and ultimately they did come to the decision to set that sentencing date to december 20th at 9 a.m it will be here in person at the olmstead county courthouse live in rochester sananda mccall kint news three sananda did you see any family members in court today there were family members of the robinson family but i did not see any from the bush family all right, thank you so much. And Robinson, we do know, leaves behind three children.